Hi, I'm Bailey, and welcome to an introduction to media production, the only shop of its kind in all the Connecticut Technical High School system. Hi, my name is Sarah. There are lots of different components to the shop, but one of the most interesting rooms we have is the studio. But first things first, if you don't like doing work and think you're going to be watching television and videos all day, you're so far from being right. That would be correct. We do a lot of work, so if you're thinking of joining the shop, you better be prepared. But on to other things, like jobs. There are many different kinds of jobs in the media production business. So if you think it's only acting and directing, you're wrong again. Well, a teleprompter, along with just about every piece of equipment in the studio, is run by the people in the control room. What a teleprompter does, it makes sure the words on the camera are moving at the same speed my co-host and I are comfortable with. That's right. The person who is cutting from me to my co-host is called the technical director. The technical director's job is to communicate with the director to make sure that the right camera is on the air at the right time using a device called the video switcher. The director's job is to communicate with everyone on the set and make sure the production goes smoothly. One of the unsung heroes is the audio director, Audio One. That person's job is to make sure everybody's voice isn't too low or too high so you can hear their voices perfect. They do this by using the audio mixer or soundboard. Okay, but what about the lighting director? That person turns dark into light using the lighting board. They make sure the lighting matches the mood we're trying to set and allows us to see what we need to see. Last on our list, but definitely not least, is the graphics designer and manager. What they do is create graphics so that they are ready to go on air, things like titles and identifications. Oh, and don't forget, we don't just stay in the studio. We go outside the shop and do stories about things in and outside the school. What we do after we produce a project is bring it to our computers and edit the footage together. We edit with a program called Premiere Pro to edit out all the video and audio we don't want, as well as mistakes we made during production, although it takes a lot of patience to get it right. Also, another thing you need to know is that when we're in theory, there's no fooling around and you need to pay attention because one, you can get into trouble and two, you won't learn anything. So basically what I'm trying to say is you only get out of it what you put into it and making TV is a lot more complex than you think and that's what we learn. There are lots of more we have to share. Well, right now we have lots of work and theory to do so we hope to see you in shop. Have, have a, a great, great day and enjoy, enjoy the rest, rest of Exploratory. exploratory.